Eugene Hairston lost his hearing at the age of two after an attack of spinal meningitis. As he grew into adulthood, he was unable to find work and wound up at a boxing gym where he learned how to read lips with the help of his trainer, Mike Mila. The first words Hairston learned to read were motion, jab, hook, and uppercut. Promoters nicknamed Hairston Dummy on billboards advertising his fights, but later this was changed to Silent Hairston. In between rounds, he remained silent as he kept his eyes on his trainer's lips to read his instructions. Hairston couldn't hear the bell, so the referee stretched out his hand to indicate the end of a round. At this point in time, he's the number six ranked middleweight in the world and got there by defeating top-notch fighters like Artie Town, Lester Felton, Lee Sala, and Kid Gavilan. Meanwhile, Patty Young comes into this fight with a record of 41-6-2 and, and has a reputation as a tough and durable sort. So the ease with which he's defeated here draws suspicion among the crowd and the referee. After Young went down for the third time, the referee asked him, Are you hurt or are you trying to quit? I'm fighting, Young replied. If you quit on me, the referee warned, I'll have you suspended for life. Young then mumbled, What the hell do you think I'm doing down here? Got up and resumed fighting Hairston to no avail. Round one, and here comes Patty Young. He wears the black trunks and Hairston the white. Both fighters are just about even weight wise. At 159 and a quarter, Hairston is just eight ounces heavier than Young. Patty, who's one of the most colorful fighters to come out of New York City, is up against a tough newcomer tonight. Hairston is only 21, but he's already high in the running for the World Middleweight Championship. This was a very exciting first round. Had all the drama packed into it that you could want. That's re referee uh, Ruby Goldstein. Patty Young on the attack. Eugene Hairston, a beautiful left hooker. And a damaging body puncher. Fine body blow by Hairston. Hairston specializes in shots along the waistline. Patty with his hands high. Young down and apparently badly hurt. The referee is counting and the count goes all the way up to nine. Young is still wobbly and the crowd is still gasping as he goes down again and holds his stomach. Now the count goes up to one, two, three, four. And at the sound of the bell, his seconds come out and bring him in. Harrison is off like a racehorse now for round two. He's trying to end this quickly as a result of those two knockdowns of Patty Young in the first round. Young very vulnerable. Young is down for a slip and up the referee. Cleans his gloves. Harrison looking for an opening. Patty Young was badly shaken up by those webs to the pit of the stomach. Here we go. He's down again from a shot high on the head. And he 
sits there as the referee, Ruby Goldstein, starts to count in his left ear, getting up real close and studying his eyes to see just how badly hurt he is. The count this time again goes to nine. This is the third knockdown in this fight. Thurston swarming all over him, trying to put him away, and a beautiful uppercut, and this time Patty falls on his face, gets up, goes back on his haunches. And the referee again is counting, this time in his right ear. The crowd is in an uproar in the background. Second count for nine. Thurston now trying to polish him off. Momentarily on the attack. Under New York State law, three knockdowns forces the end of a fight in one round, and Patty has been down twice in this round. There's some measuring him. Bobbing up and down, fainting, trying to get him to lead and open up. In the meantime, Patty's holding his glove up there to protect his chin. A shot to the body had him down, and a shot to the head had him down in this round. Both for counts of nine. He still seems to have a lot of life. There's an in and out. And again, he's down for the third time, and that's all for Patty Young, the Greenwich Village left hooker. The winner by a knockout for his 13th straight victory as a professional boxer is the deaf-mute fighter from Harlem, Eugene Hairston.